let me convince you to start with paper 1B and not paper 1A for your paper 1 exam. Normally I say things like start with the thing in the exam that you feel most comfortable with and for the vast majority of you, you definitely feel more comfortable with the paper 1A than the paper 1B. So what's making me change my mind here? Um, and it's one big thing reading time. So you get this five minutes of reading time and a choice between reading paper 1A or paper 1B. I strongly suggest that you use that time to read the wordy, weird paper 1B and try to get your head around and your head into some of those experiments um, or database stuff that you get given. Hopefully by the end of that five minutes, you also feel confident enough to have a go at some of those questions. And for lots of you, maybe even finish the paper 1B first. Now, obviously, if you read the paper 1B and you are in full freak out mode and like, I have no idea where to start or what any of this means, then absolutely do not start with that and go back to the multiple choice, do that first and then come back to the paper 1B. But, I strongly suggest that you use your five minutes of reading time for reading those weird paper 1B questions. 